There's a mountain up in Massachusetts People call it Mohawk Trail Town on that mountain is Florida The Forbidden Mountain for sure Coming into October Leaves are all turning around Turning pretty cold Greetings, I'm Krista Jan Ryan and I am your host today for Artists in the Berkshires where we bring to you the artists whose visions have made an impact in the art world. Folks, today we are going to mix the literary with the music and we have a stunning young artist who's just really added so much to the literary world. Her name is Asha Lee. And, uh, She's amazing. She is very profound. She not only has a lot of her work that she talks from and recites, but she also sings. And then we have our very own legendary Patrick Ray, who was nice enough to come in and uh, give us his best shot. So I hope you enjoy the show. I hurt myself today to see if I still feel I focus on the pain, the only thing that's real. The needle tears a hole The old familiar sting I try to kill it all away But I remember everything What have I become? My sweetest friend Everyone I know Goes away in the end And you could have it all My empire of dirt I will let you down I will make you hurt I wear this crown of thorns Upon my liar's chair Full of broken thoughts I cannot repair Beneath the stains of time The feelings disappear You are someone else But I am still right here what have I become, my sweetest friend? Everyone I know goes away in the end, and you could have it all. My pile of dirt I will let you down I will make you hurt if I could start again a million miles away I would keep myself I would find a way. And another poem. Okay, so basically I'm going to be accompanying 
certain poems and songs that I feel mesh well together and create a bigger picture than what they offer on their own. Um, okay, sorry. <laughs> Unchanging, sorry. <laughs> Unchanging and eternal is the starry night to all to human fading eyes. How these great pinpricks of fire spin and pirouette in their cosmic dance through the centuries. They are the closest thing to God we see. The most luminous stars lay before us in their bed of darkness spread across our atmosphere in ecstasy. But why do they feel so lonely, stars so ancient and dim cataracts of time forgotten calling out to us in our sublunary world begging that we recognize our own mortality. But oh, those radiant beasts, they do not long for us to slip away into oblivion, to surrender, give in, they cry for us to feel our own sacred stardust swelling within our chests. With every inhale and exhale of mortal breath, they demand that we acquiesce to a beautiful death. And in the end, there is only one question, to burn out in a blaze of glory or to fade with grace. Regardless, we too will someday be a star long forgotten, a fragment of eternity. And um, I will be singing Amazing Grace, and this one especially goes out to my mother. Amazing Grace, how sweet the sound that saved a wretch like me. I was, was lost, but now I am found. Was blind, but now I see. Twas grace that taught my heart to fear and grace. My fears relieved. How precious did that grace appear? The
smooth transition. And now I have one final poem and one final song. I can't cry because my head is killing me. Bones are weak. My body pulses, coolness and heat ebbing and flowing. Cess la vie, I promise you, this time it's true. I'm working out the kinks of me. Zoloft is a hell of a drug and I'm pagan, praying that it's working. I love you. It's the truest thing I know. The chemicals in my brain have nothing on all of the neural pathways you have forged in my heart broken and bleeding brain, I swear I will be okay. I swear I will lift you up with every piece of me. I will build a ladder with my bones, lifting you higher as I breathe. You don't need to be careful where you step. I can take it. I promise your heart will be okay. It doesn't hide beneath my ribcage. I wear it in my eyes, between my thighs, on my wrists. If it breaks, darling, it is not your fault. I am a broken vessel, but I am not empty. I am cracked and chapped and bleeding, sure, but I am still alive. I beg you to please consider filling my hollows. I'm working out the kinks in me, the cracks in my pottery, in my soul. I want you. I want you to fill, I want you to wrap your arms around me and fill this vessel with your gold. Another smooth transition. Oh yeah, okay. So um, I feel like I should probably interject here. Um, a lot of different elements, I suppose, occur throughout my poetry and throughout these songs, and it might seem like they're everywhere, and they kind of are, but they're kind of not at the same time. Um, Certain ones are inspired by the loss of my mother, by the loss of myself, by the seemingly um, impeding loss of other people. Um, but I always try to have an element of happiness, of light, of joy, somewhere hidden in there. So I encourage you to try to find it, not only in what I'm singing and what I'm saying, but in yourself too, in everything really, because you'll find it no matter how broken things seem to be, no matter how lost. And now this song, this last song that I'm going to sing, um, it also has a lot of significance to me because it's one of the songs that reminds me of my mother. And yeah, about a million songs remind me of my mom. I mean, when you lose someone, that's going to do it to you. But I had a kind of rocky relationship with her, but there were shining moments, those golden moments that I've talked about, even amidst all of the darkness. And one of those moments was riding in the car with her, listening to Fleetwood Mac and just hearing the music and just enjoying the peace and the quiet and um, I've come to treasure that now so kind of have to so I'll be singing landslide I took my love and I took it down I climbed a mountain and I turned around And I saw my reflection in the snow-covered hills And the landslide brought me down 
country come through spirit of Massachusetts is the spirit of America spirit of Massachusetts is the spirit of America my heritage is far abound my mother born in Ireland told me Massachusetts was so much like her home ground. Spirit of Massachusetts is the spirit of America. I wrote the song of the Hoosick Tunnel, song of the Mohawk Trail. What pleases me more is to write of the state which holds these landmarks tall. Spirit of Massachusetts is the spirit of America. From Cape Cod to California, from Atlantic to Pacific, the state I hold most dear to me Yes, you know it's Massachusetts Spirit of Massachusetts Is the spirit of America Spirit of Massachusetts Is the spirit of America Well, thank you very much. Thank you very much. That's uh, that's one of the songs, and uh, of course the uh, the history of the uh, Hoosick Tunnel uh, in, in in song uh, 
is, is one that I did a number of years ago. And uh, I moved up onto the trail, oh, back about 37 years ago, thereabouts. And my wife, of course, is uh, from the, uh, the people that settled up on the mountain originally. Uh, she was Scandinavian. They were from Sweden and Norway. Um, and uh, they settled up on top of the mountain. And uh, when I moved up there, I, it was like I was being beckoned to write this story and song. And um, later I found out that the, the train would be coming through close to the Hoosick Tunnel, which was down below our home. And so I was, I was sort of beckoned to write this song. And uh, it is the theme song of the Hoosick Tunnel. I'm, I'm proud to say that I've, that I've written it, and uh, uh, a lot of people enjoy it. So uh, we'll go ahead and try it for you. This is a song of the Hoosick Tunnel. One of the largest tunnels in the world. And 195 men died there. task, the digging of a tunnel in North Adams, Mass. Hard times and labor was not the only plague. Water, cavings was all the tunnel gave. In the tunnel, in the tunnel, in the tunnel. In the tunnel boom, boom. 1867 A fire broke out T'was in the central shaft And thirteen men died For the mournful task In the tunnel In the tunnel After lives toil and money, the East met the West, and the Hoosig was history in the tunnel, in the tunnel, in the tunnel, in the tunnel. I stand here on the ground Hundreds of feet higher Listening to the sound Of those many men Way down in the ground In the tunnel In the tunnel In the tunnel Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Um, so uh, 
let's see, I don't have my, my, usually, uh, my usual uh, son and uh, drummer and whatever with me, so uh, we're just going to do this, uh, you know, as it is, and we hope you enjoy it. Uh, another song that I had written about the uh, Massachusetts, of course, about the oldest known Indian footpath in the United States, which is the, uh, the Mohawk Trail. And uh, this is the first song, I believe, that was written and recorded about the Mohawk Trail. And uh, just a little rough, so I'm just going to go ahead and play it for you. There's a mountain up in Massachusetts. People called it Mohawk Trail. Town on that mountain is Florida. The forbidden mountain for sure. October leaves are all turning around, turning pretty colors of red, orange, and brown. When the truck drivers are hauling over that Omaha trail, they all come to a slow halt for in the road. Dead man's curve, dead man's curve. Many a truck driver went over it, many didn't come back. They all stopped for a moment to remember that awesome. Standing on that mountain, looking into heaven's door, you can easily understand it while life goes on. On this forbidden show, while life goes on. On this forbidden show. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Um, the next uh, song I'd like to do for you uh, is a, uh, a song that I wrote that was uh, inspired while I was uh, studying the, uh, the history of the Hoosick Tunnel. And uh, hopefully I've got it here. <laughs> Don't mind my, my papers. There we go. And this song here was uh, uh, performed at the uh, Springfield Symphony Hall in Springfield, Massachusetts in 1986. And uh, uh, we did that song uh, when we were doing the Spirit of Springfield, Massachusetts uh, celebration. And uh, while I was studying the history of the Hoosick Tunnel, I I went up to the, the railroad trestle there uh, in Hoosick Tunnel, the town. And uh, as I was there and, and studying the, the area, I, I noticed or I saw a vision of what appeared to be a World War I uh, soldier coming home from war. Um, and uh, he had his, his full garb on, his, his rifle and his backpack and this, this short helmet they had and I believe it must have been World War One and uh, so I was inspired to write this song The Blue Hills of Massachusetts and I uh, I don't have my bugler with me but usually when at the end of the song uh, as they did in this the uh, spirit of Springfield uh, celebration uh, the 86th Army Band uh, did the bugle at the end so uh, sorry I don't have that but if you can just picture the key the uh, bugle being played at the end of this then uh, to the taps, then you'll get an idea of what this song is all about. I see the shores of Cape Cod 
and the San Franciscan light. I remember those blue hills etched in my memory tonight. train ran through the tunnel on a cold and lonely day from the blue hills of massachusetts i was going far away was leaving my hometown for a war that may be won i was singing America's song for freedom we're all one and in my mind the memory I'm standing all alone I'm back in Massachusetts my blue hills mountain home He's coming home, full flag clothed in a golden box of death. He's seen the sadder part of war, but he's coming home at last. Yes, here I am once again, I'm standing all alone. I'm back in Massachusetts, my Blue Hills mountain home. Back in Massachusetts, my Blue Hills mountain Massachusetts. And as we move along here, um, the uh, next song I'd like to do for you, uh, when I was a young man, about 16 or 17, I was drafted and uh, went to Albany, New York, where we were supposed to go from there to Vietnam and uh, unfortunately <laughs> I wanted to go and unfortunately I had asthma so they, they told me I couldn't I couldn't go but anyhow the uh, the lives of the soldiers and the friends of mine that I've lost in Vietnam and all of the other wars I, I remember uh, quite well and um, I wrote this song the name of the song is a soldier and uh, it deals with a number of, of different uh, wars and crises that this country has gone through. And um, I'd like to do that song for you right now. The name of it is The Soldier. Fought in the war of the revolution, the war between the states. Raise the flag at Iwo Jima. The Alamo remembers their fate. Froze in the mountains of North Korea. Lost friends at the Battle of the Bulge. Fought in the fight of the racial 60s. While Castro was nearing our shores. And nobody knows their name, sweet Jesus. No, nobody knows their names. They're buried in a grave like so many soldiers. Nobody knows their names. Walked 
in the swamps of that Mekong Delta was booed when they came back home. Flew the plane over Lockerbie, Scotland. Nobody asked where they've gone. Fought the drugs on the streets of Boston. Came home from Saudi barely alive. So the tears on mothers' faces, thanking God some children survive. And nobody knows their name, sweet Jesus. No, nobody knows their names. They're buried in a grave like so many soldiers. Nobody knows their names. Lost. Their lives trying to save our loved ones That tragic 9-11 day When down in a Black Hawk on foreign soil Protecting the USA And nobody knows their name, sweet Jesus No, nobody knows their names They're buried in a grave like so many soldiers Nobody knows their names. No, nobody knows their names. No, nobody knows their names. And that is the soldier. And the next song we'd like to do for you. Is a uh, this song here I performed with uh, with Christopher Reeve at Williams College back in the uh, the early '90s, and um, it's the song of peace, and um, I'll just go right ahead and, and do it for you. From Russia to America. North Pole to the South There's love in all the people It's a cry from mouth to mouth Being able to share Peace, love and care Is the worldly message For everyone to hear So let us rise up and stand Take each other's hand this is our song of peace throughout our earth land. There is sorrow and grief, sadness and pain. We all join together and love will always reign. So let us rise up and stand, take each other's hand. This is our song of peace throughout our earth land. To find the reason why, look in your neighbor's eye. And if you see a tear, comfort them until it dries. Let there be love, peace, and harmony. Let there be unity from sea to shining sea. Let there be understanding so all the world can learn. Let there be peace for all the world's concerns. So let us rise up and stand, take each other's hand. This is our song of peace throughout our earth land. From Russia to America, North Pole to the South, there's love in all the people. It's a cry from mouth to mouth. So let us rise up and stand. Take each other's hand. This is our song of peace throughout our earthly land. Won't you rise up and stand? Take each other's hand. This is our song of peace throughout our earthly land. Something like that. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you very much.
Well, let me see. I think uh, that should just about do it. Uh, I'm sorry. Let's see. One more. Well, let us see. What do we have here? Uh, you know, uh, we, we do Irish music, and I know a lot of people like to hear some of the Irish music, and uh, so we were just asked to do one more song here, so uh, what we'll do is we'll, we'll try this one here. Haven't done it in quite a while, but what the heck? This is uh, Dublin in the real times. Raised on songs and stories, heroes of renown, the past and tales and glories that once was Dublin town. The hallowed halls and houses, the haunting children's rhymes that once was Dublin city in the rear. Old times ring a ring the rosy as the light declines. I remember Dublin City in the rare old times. My name it is Sean Dempsey, as Dublin as could be, born hard and laid in Pimlico. Be. My trade it was a cooper, stout to redundancy, like my house that fell to progress, my trade's memory. I courted Peggy Dignan, as pretty as you please. A raging child of Mary From the rebel liberties I lost her to a student chap With skin as black as coal When he took her off to Birmingham She took away my soul Care thee well, sweet Anna Lippy. I can no longer stay and watch me new past cages spring up along the cave. My mind's too full of memories, too old to hear new chimes. I'm part of what was Dublin in the rare old times. As the light declines, I remember Dublin City in the rare old times. I remember Dublin City in the rare old times. Well, thank you very much. Well, thank you. Let's pray. Let's pray. 